How to make a puppet theater shirt. To make a puppet theater shirt, you will need a cereal box, some tape, a glue stick, a scissors, toilet roll, grease proof paper, a ruler, and a pencil. Step one. For this step, you will need your cereal box and just fold it out like that. And then what you need to do is get your scissors and cut it into two pieces. Step two. For this step, you will need your cardboard pieces and draw out the shape of your theatre. You can use the lines on the boxes if you want. And then what you do is you cut it out. Step three. So when you have your first bit cut out, copy it onto the other piece. But you have to make sure they're the same size. Step four. So when you have your two pieces cut out, you need to get your ruler and your pencil and measure one centimeter on every side to make your to make your frame. Step five. So when you have your two pieces measured and all ready, what you're gonna do is get your scissors and cut in to the frame and start cutting it up. Step six. So when you have your two pieces cut out and ready, what you need to do is get your tape and tape off where you cut. Step seven. So when you have your pieces taped off, what you need to do is get your glue stick and glue the two pieces together. Step eight. When you have your two pieces glued together to make the frame stronger, next what you need to do is get your grease proof paper and put the frame onto it. Now when you're tracing around it, make sure you don't trace around the inside because then you won't have places to glue. So trace around the outside. Step nine. So when you have your piece drawn out on your greaseproof paper, now what you need to do is cut it out. So when you have your greaseproof paper cut out, what you need to do is get your glue stick and glue it on to your frame. When you have your greaseproof paper stuck on, your screen should look like this. To make a stand for your puppet theater, you need to get your three toilet rolls and fold them and then you need to cut a snip to make the stand. And then you do it with all three and slide the little slip through your t-shirt. When you're done, your t-shirt should look like this. Now that you have your t-shirt made, it's time to make your puppets. Today we're going to be making the children of Lear. So this is what you need. Your picture, a pencil, glue, 
cardboard or a cereal box, a scissors, and black card. Oh, and you will also need lollipop sticks. Step one. First, what you need to do is cut out your picture. When you have your character cut out, what you need to do is glue it onto your sheet. Next, what you need to do is trace around your character. And do this with all of your characters. Now you cut it out. If you want to make your puppet stronger, put it onto the cardboard and cut it out. Now that you have all your puppets cut out, now it's time to glue them onto the sticks. This is what your puppet should look like. Now you're ready to put on your first puppet show. Children of Lur, take one, scene one. Over time, Aoife got jealous of, of the children's beauty. So one day, when Lur was out hunting, she took the children on a walk to the river to have some fun. But the children didn't know that it was actually a trick to turn them all into swans. I, I cast my magic to turn each and every one of you into swans. Don't turn us into swans. You will, you will stay at every lake for 300 years. <laughs>